Let's see if I can rekindle the fire. Hmm, nothing happened. Maybe I need some tinder. I have found all four symbols. Now let's see if I can get it open. Let's see what's inside. All it contained was a lump of coal. It doesn't look ordinary, though. What am I supposed to do with this coal? I'd better go and ask Dad. After all, he's the one who bought it last year. Dad, what is this wooden box? Where did you find it? In the attic, along with all the other junk. Yes, now I remember. I bought it last Christmas from a weird antique shop as a present. The guy who owns the store told me some strange things about it. Something like... It's unique and magical... And a portal, I think. He insisted that I should only open it at Christmas. I believe he was trying to talk me into buying it. And he did! Why are you asking? Because I opened it, and all it had inside was a vague letter and a lump of coal. Really? Nice. At least you opened it at Christmas. I wish I knew what to do with it. I don't know. Burn it, put it back, throw it away. Dad! Right. Sorry. Consider it an adventure. You can do whatever you want. However, one last thing that guy told me is that if I didn't open it last Christmas... I should pass it on to another family with a kid in middle childhood or adolescence. <laughs> That's strange. The first part of the Guilty's concert is over. Right now, we'll continue with our regular TV program. Don't forget to check back in an hour or so for the second part. That band rocks. I can't wait for the second part. Until then, I better get back to my room. I know it's a sin to waste such a rare and expensive whiskey, but this will do the trick. All right, let's put an end to this weird night. I hope that strange glow will disappear so I can go back to bed and wake up for Christmas. It just turned blue. I don't know what I was expecting. I guess that's it. Back to my bed. What was that? Oh no, not again. Wait a minute, Cosmos is glowing. Cosmos? Not really. You're talking. You're levitating! You're glowing! You... You 
look stunned. Who are you? Well, I think you mean what I am. What are you? I'm the Christmas spirit. However, you may call me Cosmos, just like your beloved teddy bear. What happened to Cosmos? Do not worry. I just needed a vessel to possess. Oh boy, that sounds evil. On the contrary. Where I come from, spirits tend to do this. If the situation requires it, we possess lifeless things in order to be able to visit your world. Nevertheless, we would never dwell in a body with a soul, my dear Cisco. That's what demons do. Hey, you know my name. Of course, I'm the Christmas spirit. I know every kid's name. You've already said that. How is that even possible? People believe that the Christmas spirit is just a concept. That's half the truth. The other half is that I'm a supernatural being, an actual spirit. Wow, that's mind blowing. I'm responsible for the mood during this holiday period, for all the hope, giving, good cheer, and love. Everything that Christmas stands for. <sighs> and I hope it will remain alive for the future to come. You seem worried. Indeed, that's why I'm visiting your world. Is there anything I can do to help? I sure hope so, since I chose you among all the kids in the world. My dear Cisco, get ready for a remarkable adventure. You must save Christmas. That sounds familiar. Was that you on the radio? As a matter of fact, it was. Everything sounds weird. What do you mean, save Christmas? Hold on tight, my boy. Santa has been kidnapped. What? As you know, it's already the night before Christmas, and with Santa missing, kids won't get their presents. That may signify the end of anything Christmassy. That's terrible! Who would do such a thing? I really can't be sure. That's something for you to find out, Cisco. But I can tell you whose help you are going to need. Yours? I'm sure, I'm going to be your sidekick through this adventure. But I'm referring to an ancient witch, one of Santa's oldest allies. The all-knowing Labafana! So, why me? It wasn't exactly a choice. For some random reason, that strange wooden box ended up in your hands. It could have ended up with any other kid. So, it was just a matter of luck? Maybe, maybe not. Huh? I mean, everything happens for a reason, right? I think that a certain chain of events led to that box being in your hands. But it was your kind soul, along with your love of Christmas, that made you not want to pass it on. Honestly, it was just my dad who couldn't be bothered to pass it on. Instead, he just threw it in the attic, along with all the other useless stuff. I see. In any case, you've been chosen. Oh boy, all this sounds too much. I wouldn't know what to do. I have faith in you, Cisco. I also understand. So, here's the short version. Santa has been kidnapped, and the essence of Christmas is at stake. But fear not, because I, the Christmas spirit, will be your companion throughout your quest to save Santa and restore good cheer to this time of the year. For reasons of intimacy, you better call me Cosmos, and I strongly recommend as our next step to go and find La Bufana. She will be able to tell us who has done this and how to rescue Santa. And how am I supposed to find her? Don't worry, I'll take us there. Omnipotent Labafana, oh ancient one, hear my invocation. Oh bringer of ashes and coal, upon the dark, beneath the full moon, on this magical night of the year, it's time for my old roots to prune. I seek forecast of the new from an all-knowing such as you. Where are we going? You ask too many questions, Cisco. 
Prepare yourself, for our journey begins. It's time only for answers. Shouldn't we look for transportation or something? Well, defying gravity gives me the ability of flying. And if I can fly, then so can you. I'm actually flying! <laughs> it tickles a bit, but still the best feeling ever! Woohoo! Hold your breath, Cisco. We're not there yet. So, here we are. You'll be able to find La Bafana somewhere around here. What is this place? It's the Yule Forest, one of the oldest wildwoods related to Christmas. In ancient times, spirits gathered here in a secret council to protect their festivals from the evil ones. But over time, this tradition was lost. Nowadays, people come together to this forest to celebrate, organizing fun fairs. They usually last for 12 nights. I believe there's a fair for La Bufana near here. So, it won't be that hard to track her down. To be honest, it gives me the creeps! And that story of yours didn't help, actually! There's no time for hesitation, Cisco. If the evil is the one I think it is, then it won't be that easy to release Santa. The night won't last for long. You must act! Hey, kid. How may I help you? Do you know where I can find La Bifana? I see. Another adventure. Just follow the signs. What is this place? Well, it's a seasonal festival that happens every year in honor of La Bifana. People from all over the world come to attend the festivities. I've never heard of it before. Sounds interesting. Sure. I have to go. Bye! The Hunt. Latest issue. All the tricks about hunting. Come on, the fire is out. I believe the ceremony is over. Although they seem to keep the embers lit. Probably to celebrate more later. Come on, folks. Try your luck. Get a chance hey, kid. You are not allowed try. to take any. Really? Why is that? You have to be over 18. Most of this stuff is really dangerous. Darn it. That doesn't look like a potion bottle. Hey, kid, you're not allowed to take any. Really? You have to put it... Oh, fine then. Go ahead and take it. I don't want anything here except my merchandise. Hello! Greetings. I'm Lazarus. What are you selling? 
Isn't it obvious? Magic potions and elixirs. Impressive. What do they do? Well, most of them are for magical purposes, while others are medicinal. And just a few of them are poisonous, but let this remain between us. Sounds like some of them might be useful for my adventure. How old are you, kid? Twelve. Sorry, young one. I'm not allowed to sell you any unless you're over 18 or you have the consent of an adult. Got it. I have more questions. Your mustache is so weird. It's a personality trait. It took me quite a time to grow it to this length. I wish I could grow a mustache like that. Wait for puberty, kid. Then the possible styles will be endless. Sorry, I should get going. Excuse me? Welcome, kid. What is the great prize? An extraordinary souvenir from the birthplace of La Befana. Sounds like a must-have. How do I win the great prize? You'll have to play a game and win. Are you up for this challenge? I was born ready. Easy, kid. Don't get overexcited. Let's find out. Do you have any tokens? Unfortunately, I do not. I'm sorry to hear that, but without tokens, you can't play. That's a shame. Any idea of how I can acquire some? Try asking at the information booth. I should get going. It was nice talking to you. Hello? Is anyone in there? Hey, kid. How may I help you? May I have some tokens, sir? I'm sorry, kid. They're all gone for today. Come back tomorrow. But I really need them tonight! As I said, there's nothing I can do. Fine. I have to go. Bye! It has a unique theme, with reindeer and witches instead of horses. Could it be a wishing well? You seem a bit gloomy. Is everything okay? Not really. I have a problem with my candy making machine. For some reason, I cannot create La Befana special treat for naughty kids. Oh, that's so disappointing. Isn't there a technician you can call? At this time of day, you can hardly find someone. I might be able to help you. Oh my gosh, really? Yes, I'm quite a handyman. Once I took our TV apart just to see what's inside. Dad got furious, but I managed to put it back together, and now everyone is happy. It seems like you are my only choice. I'll tell you what, if you manage to fix it, I'll give you La Befana special candy for free. Challenge accepted. Is there anything I should know about your candy making machine before I take a look at it? Well, the color of the crystal sugar that I want to create is black. But the machine doesn't produce it. So I guess that if you fix the black color, then everything will work fine. I'll take action ASAP. That would be awesome, but I don't know how to operate it. 
That's where the real magic happens! A candy-making machine! This must be Labafana's tent! The first goal achieved! Now to the next one! How to get inside and meet her! Oh! I see a few people in line! That's not good! There's no time to wait my turn! I may have to bypass them! I don't see any opening! Maybe it's used as a repository! Wow! La Bifana's tent really stands out! I can't wait to meet her! Hello! Welcome, little one! I'm here to see La Bifana! You'll have to wait in line, just like everyone else. But it's really important I see her! I bet. That's what everybody says. There are a lot of people waiting in line. I don't have much time! I have to see her immediately! You are too young to be impatient. Relax. You can always come back tomorrow. You don't understand! If dawn comes, it will be too late! There won't be any Christmas to celebrate! La Bifana is the only one who can help me save the holidays! Look, kid, you sound worried. I get that. But I can't just let you in. Which means... To be a guardian means to protect and defend as equal, no matter what. But you haven't said no, right? What are you implying? Maybe there's another way to come to an agreement. Maybe. You are a witty little boy. I like that. If you answer correctly all three questions regarding Labafana, then I might be able to let you sneak in through the back door. Agreed! The first question is... What is the birthplace of Labafana? Rivendell! Nope. Not even close. Let's move to the next question. What is La Bafana's treat for naughty kids? Candy canes! What a pity. That's incorrect. And finally, which flower is associated with La Bafana? Wild Orchid! What a pity! That's incorrect. Well, let's see. You haven't answered all three questions correctly. I was nervous! Please ask me again! I'm afraid I can't do that. If you want to see La Bafana, you'll have to wait in line over there. Drat! There's no time to waste! I beg you, please! Oh, fine. Stop whining. Come back once you know more and I'll ask you again. Now shove off! Where do you think you're going, kid? I was told the restroom is back there. You've been told wrong. If you need to, use those bushes back there in the tents. Now get back. <laughs> <laughs> 